Hello everyone, this is Roxas159. Welcome to the finale of Let's Play Final Fantasy X HD Remastered. Well, we've done it, ladies and gentlemen. We've defeated Sin, destroyed Yu Yevin, and brought the eternal calm. So, let us watch the final cutscene of the game, which was added into the international and HD versions. So, let's start. Thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one. <sighs> Two minutes, forty-one seconds. My longest yet. Yuna, it's time. Coming. Mm. You're diving like a real pro, yeah? <laughs> You'll always be the pro, Waka. I don't know. It's been so long since I trained. <laughs> you have gotten a little chubby. <laughs> oh, oh, no. And you're not even the one having the baby. Oh. It's been two years. I've learned how to hold my breath for more than two minutes now. It takes more than physical strength, and there are some tricks you can't be taught. It took practice, lots and lots of practice. I just had to keep trying until I figured it out for myself. And you know what? Back then, I didn't think there were any tricks to it at all. I didn't have time to think. An eternal calm. A slightly chubby waka. And my two minutes, 41 seconds. It's not much, but it's enough. So it's been two years since the Eternal Calm started. Two years since we've defeated Sin. Lady Yuna, it is a pleasure to meet you. I, I heard your speech two years ago in the stadium, but seeing you this close, you, you look so much more... I, I mean, you are truly beautiful. That's very kind of you to say. The reason I've come here today is to talk to you about my grandson. He's joined the Youth League, you see. I, I have nothing against the League, mind you. It's just me and the missus belong to New Yevin. My grandson used to attend all the party meetings with his parents, of course. That is, until one day. Huh. I'm sure being around people his own age can't be bad for the boy. Still, I am worried about him. I feel, oh, how shall I say this? Like our grandchildren are moving too quickly. 
In the last two years, new groups have been springing up all over. Everyone wants to be part of a new age. Everyone wants to build a new age. Everyone wants to build a new Spira. And they're all racing to find their own way to do it. I only want what's best for him. But it troubles me when we agree on so little. People have different ideas. And sometimes, they disagree on the right thing to do. Some people worry about what the New Age will bring. Sometimes, I worry too. I just have to tell myself that for now, I'm doing the right thing. I understand how you feel. But Tastio, maybe you should try talking to your grandson first. He may walk a different path, but I'm sure he wants the same for Spira, as we all do. So, seems things aren't all peachy in this eternal calm. Hey there! What is it, another visitor? No, no, I just wanted to chat, yeah? It's just, uh, the old folks in the village. They'd like to see you get, uh, you know. And who is it this time? Well, they're saying it's the son of the chairman of New Yevon, yeah? Tell them no. He would only use me for the draw. Ah. Uh, right. I'm sorry. Don't worry. I'll go tell them myself. No, no, you leave that to me, yeah? Huh? You really don't want to see them anyway. You know how they get. Yeah. Lady Yuna! <sighs> Lady Yuna, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Yaibo. I've come on Youth League business. I bring a message for you from our leader, Maven Nuge. She's not interested in joining, yeah? Oh? Is that why you've come? That is correct, my lady. I'm sorry, but I will not be joining any group. Perhaps the lady will start a group of her own. <laughs> Leave us, please. Seems things are getting pretty busy around here. Riku sometimes visits us here in Besaid. She's been traveling around Spira, salvaging ancient machina and teaching people how to use them. It's tiring work, but you wouldn't know it from looking at her. <laughs> hey, cut it out! Love sure got a handle on you. Where's Lulu? Back in a village. Go say hi, yeah? You betcha. And Yuna, you seem the same as always. Yeah, same as always. Is Kamari still on Mount Gagazet? Yeah, he's been up there teaching the orphan Ronzo all kinds of stuff. He's like this big guru now. Oh, that reminds me. I got something for you. Where is it? Where is it? Uh, here we go. Kamari found it up on the mountain. A sphere? Funny looking design, yeah? 
Take a good look, Yuna. It was a voice from the past. No, it was a voice that's never left me. What is this? What's he doing? I mean, is that really him? Is that... is he... what's going on? I'm not sure. But you want to find out, don't ya? Well, yeah, but... Yes! Let's go, then! Go where? Well, that's the tricky part. I know. Kimari found the sphere. Let's go talk to him. Whoa, whoa. You sure you're ready to just run off? Can't you wait until we find out a little more first? And just who's supposed to do the finding out? Leave that to us. I'm sure Maven Nuge will agree to help. In fact, I volunteer to ask him myself. Peter, yeah. Understood. I shall return as soon as possible with the full report of our investigation. Well, look, I really want Yuna to go. She can't do that. Why not? Because she's book solid for three months, yeah? And everybody wants to see her. Oh, yeah? Well, what about what she wants? Well, yeah, but... <sighs> okay, maybe once things calm down, you know? And what if they don't, Waka? What then, huh? I don't believe it. After everything Yuna did for us. Why can't she just do what she wants to do now? Why? You know, every time I visited here, I wondered, why is it that when everyone's out making their dreams happen, and everyone's getting their chance, Yuna's dreams are on hold? Gee, it's not like you... Ooh. What do you know anyway, Tubby? Yuna? I want... I want to journey again. But if I leave, I'll be disappointing everyone else. I want... What's the point of pretending to be all grown up if it means the things I want to say never get said? How am I supposed to change anything? Hmm. I'll go. Yuna! <sighs> I know it's selfish, but this is my story. Right on! <laughs> I knew you'd say that, so I brought something just to you. Give me a break. First, a costume change. <laughs> you need a new look. You are a celebrity, so incognito's the way to go. Look, wait, you two. Uh, I'll go get Lou. An eternal calm. A slightly chubby waka. And my two minutes, 41 seconds. It's not much, but it's enough. Still, it's okay to want more, isn't it? Let's leave. 
Let's leave right now. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Final Fantasy X HD Remastered. Created and developed by Squaresoft, now known as Square Enix. My thoughts on Final Fantasy X as a whole. This game is still a lot of fun to play. I will admit the story towards the end goes a little bit too silly for me and isn't really held up as well as I thought it would. But overall, the combat is a lot of fun to play because you can plan out your moves without having to worry about being attacked or having to think too quickly. You can plan your moves, which is something that other Final Fantasies I sometimes wish would do, but not always. But how do I think the project went? I think the project went pretty well I mean, there were the breaks in between videos from time to time, but compared to the fact that this was originally the first project that I had to cancel and then replace with Bioshock, I'm glad that I was able to come back to it years later, this time through the HD version of the game, and play through it. It was a l really challenging to grind up to getting to the point of fighting the super bosses. So I haven't really done that in a long time and believe me, I'm not gonna be doing that anytime soon because this game is going back onto the shelf for quite a while. But where does this leave us with the rest of the Final Fantasy series? And more importantly, I know some people are probably wondering, Final Fantasy X2, the sequel to Final Fantasy X. I won't be doing that for quite a while, so expect seeing that in about 8 years. But to be serious, I'm not going to be doing another Final Fantasy game for a while, and if I do another Final Fantasy game soon enough, it won't be Final Fantasy X2. I'll probably do Final Fantasy XII next as my next Final Fantasy game, because that is my personal favorite one. That or 9? But I haven't really decided yet. All I know is, for right now, we're finished with Final Fantasy X, and that is great. I mean, I've had really a lot of fun with this project, and it being my first Final Fantasy game, it's great that other people who are watching that probably have never played Final Fantasy X before. So that's always the joy whenever I'm doing these types of projects. But you're also probably wondering, Roxas, what's going to be taking Final Fantasy X's place? Well, I have a straw poll going on to decide what will be taking Final Fantasy X's place. And if you go and vote in it, then you'll be able to see what game I eventually end up doing. The choices are Bioshock Infinite, Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days, or Ratchet and Clank Size Matters. But anyway guys, I'm going to end it off right here. This has been Roxas1359, and... I thank you all for watching my Let's Play of Final Fantasy X HD Remastered. Hope to see you for future projects.